In this video, we shall discuss about metadata, which is an important concept in .NET internals. We know that, in order to properly use an entity, one must know more information about that entity. So in the simplest of definition, metadata of an item is the information about itself. Let's take a real-time example. Consider a mobile phone. The processor, RAM and screen size are the part of its specification to build that particular brand of phone. So we can also say it is the design time metadata. There is one more data important for the phone, that is how to use the phone, how to call, how to SMS, how to use apps. These are all the operation of the phone which is called operation metadata. Now let's take into software sense, we are creating a mobile phone class. Then information about the data members is the manufacture metadata and information about its method is the operation metadata of the class. In .NET, both this information are stored into two different data structures. Information about data members is stored at E class structure and information about the method is stored at method table structure. Both combination is the total metadata of the class. Now we learned that the class metadata is been separated into two different structures but now we are interested which part of .NET metadata is heavily in use. For that we will again take mobile phone example. Consider the mobile phone manufacturing unit, 100 workers are assembling the phone, they must know the design time metadata. But if the phone is reached to the market and 100,000 users are using the phone daily, they are more interested in operating the phone. So from here we know that operation metadata has heavier usage than manufacture metadata. This is true in the case of object because object creation happens once but the object usage is happening are many. So that is the reason .NET designers has embedded the empty part of metadata that is operation metadata into the object layout. So in the next sample we will discuss why this object address is been embedded to the operation metadata. Okay, That we will be discussed in the second part. We request our users to go through and then subscribe to our videos. Thank you.